Yo, what's good, y'all? You already know what it is, man. It's the God Original. That shit is House of Love. Uh huh. Back out in Jamaica, Queens, of C3. Yeah, yeah. C3, what's good? Not much, man. I'm chilling, getting ready for this battle, yo. Yo, so you got E Heart. That's a big one. Super big. This is my biggest battle of my career. This is I mean, how's your preparation for that? I mean, are you going extra hard on your preparation? Um, I'm actually trying to like change. Well, I can't. I don't want to give up too much, but I'm just trying to be more free with my pen, like I used to be in the beginning. Like I be too critical of myself now, so it'd be hard for me to write. So I'm just trying to like take, unlock my brain, and just and just open up for this battle. Mm. I mean, it, it, you feel E Hard is your toughest opponent? Definitely. She's un she technically she's undefeated. You know what I'm saying? And not only that, but people consider her the queen. When you ask who's the queen of the ring, a lot of people feel that's E Hart. So it's like I'm, it's almost a title shot for me. You feel me? So this is definitely the biggest battle of my career right now. Mm. So you an official? That that was supposed to be a two on two. Y'all was supposed to be battling um. K Shine the DNA. Yeah. K Shine the DNA. What happened with that? Um. Well, you know, official got summer madness. So she's she's battling hustle for summer madness. So she couldn't do both, which I don't blame her for. Summer madness is a big big opportunity. So she couldn't do it at the moment. So, but good look. Good thing is Forty and Bonnie gonna step in and, and handle that. So I'm I'm definitely looking forward to seeing that. And maybe me and official can still do it with the two on two in the future. Hopefully. So how did you and official link up as far as being a two on two is concerned? How did y'all link up? Um. I think it I think it all started with a post or something with when DNA said who should they battle in the two on two and then a lot of fans said me and official. So Debo called us like, yo, what up? Y'all y'all do it? So we was like, Yeah, and we were supposed to do it from there. But like I said, she gotta she gotta focus for that summer madness card. So hopefully we'll we'll still get that battle done. So who you looking for looking forward to seeing other than yourself and E Heart on the NHB two card? Um, honestly, I'm looking forward to all the battles. I think all the battles are gonna be interesting that night. I, I think it's I think it's a good card. Like Katoa and Tori, that shit is gonna be <laughs> that might be battle of the night. I believe they, I know that shit gonna be crazy. The two on two definitely gonna be crazy because I know the ladies not gonna sleep on those guys. And Shun, you got Shuni and Mulatto. That's definitely gonna be a good battle. You know, Shuni Shuni funny as hell. Mulatto got some balls. You know what I'm saying? So that's gonna be a good back and forth. And Don Lady's always fucking entertaining, you know what I'm saying? Casey J, she's an up and comer, she on her ride, so I think the the card is pretty just all around dope. I'm actually looking forward to seeing all of the battles, honestly. Who you think uh, who you think gonna take it between Katoa and Tori? I, I don't know. I don't know. That the, it's hard to beat Tori <laughs> in in the city, man. You can it's hard to beat her at that ring. They fucking love her and well, they both got cults, really, so that, that's going to be a hard one to call because they love Couture just as much as they love Tori, so I don't know. I guess whoever swinging harder that day, going to come out. I can't I can't really call it right now. And you battled Mulatto Black. How do you yeah. feel she's going to do against Shuni? I think I think Mulatto's definitely going to come with hella balls. She seemed like she pretty focused from, I seen the blog she did. I know she's going to come with, with hella balls. She, she could punch like a motherfucker, so I know she's not going to play with Shuni, especially with Shuni being a big name. You know what I'm saying this this is an even bigger battle for her than me and her battle because Shuni's a bigger name than me. Like Shuni's one of the original girls, so I know Mulatto not gonna take it lightly. But I definitely don't think Shuni gonna come light neither. You know what I'm saying? It seems like they got a little tension right there, so I'm looking forward to seeing it. So what you think uh, what you think gonna pan out between the hustle and um official situation? I see they going back and forth and things of that nature. What you think gonna happen? I don't know. I, I mean I don't know. Like I seen a little bit of it of them going back and forth. I don't I've been taking a little social media break so I don't really know exactly what's going on, but I'm just hoping they still just do the battle. I hope all this just makes the battle better and it, it builds some tension so they both come out swinging and put on a show for Summer Madness so they keep putting female battles on the Summer Madness card. You got anything lined up after E Heart? Um no, not yet. Not not yet. I'm supposed to I'm supposed to battle my verse or some of Madness weekend, but I don't know if we it's set in stone or whatever. But right now my schedule is pretty clear, so we're just gonna see what happens. If I if I win, I might take a break. That's for sure. Nah, but I don't know. We'll see. I'm pretty open right now. All right, C3 in the building. Good uh -huh. luck on NHB2. Yo, NHB2, August 9th, BB Kings. Get your fucking tickets. Come out, show some support. The ladies are going to put on. You know how clean in the ring do, so come show some love. Give us some support. We here, baby. You already know. All right, C3, All right. peace.